to tell you an interesting chicken fact. Because chickens have no teeth, they eat their food, or we eat our food, whole. So how do we grind our food? We grind our food in our stomachs. In this particular lesson, we're going to be learning how to convert fractions into non-repeating decimals. These are fractions or rational numbers. Rational numbers, of course, have numerators that are integers and denominators that are integers. The line between the 1 and the 4, or the numerator and the denominator, means that we can divide. It signifies division. 4 into 1. 4 divides into 10, twice, 2 times 4 is 8. Subtract, bring down the 0. 4 into 20 goes 5 times, 5 times 4 is 20. We have a remainder of 0. So, 1 fourth has an equivalent decimal of 25 hundredths. Two fifths. Five into two. Five goes into twenty four times. Four times five is twenty. So the equivalent decimal to the rational number two fifths is four tenths fraction can be converted. And in our final example, 3 eighths, 8 into 3, 8 into 30 goes 3 times, 3 times 8 is 24, subtract, bring down the 0, 8 goes into 60 about 7 times, 7 times 8 is 56, the remainder is 4, and another 0. 8 goes into 40, how many times? That's right, 5 times, it goes in evenly. 5 times 8 is 40. So, our fraction could be converted into the decimal 375 thousandths. That's how we convert fractions into decimals using long division.